Hi guys, this is the first ever problem on a code forces contest. The first ever problem. So it is called theta square. So in theta square, we'll just quickly jump into the problem. So what it says is, the they will give you a n by n rectangular shape, and uh, they will also give you a a by a size square. You have to fill the square in this shape so that the entire uh, path is covered. So let's say n value is 6 and m value is 9 and a value is 4. How many blocks you need so that the entire thing is covered? So suppose if it is a value is 4, uh, if you consider the top length, how many fours you need? 4. 4. Only 8 is covered. So one more is there. So we need to, we cannot break that stone. We have to put one more 4. So we need 3 squares. Here how much? We can cover with one 4 and still two more will be left right four five six so we will do one more four so what is the total area if we uh, merge everything the total area will be there will be six squares how did i get it this is the product of three into two so there are two squares right that one and uh, how did i derive this value as nine three so if uh, you if you know basic programming or math you say that it is nine divided by four you get the value as 3. So since everybody knows this, let's try something differently. We are not going to do anything with uh, long double or float like that. We will do only with long long and integer. So if it's an integer, 9 by 4, what will it give? It gives 2, right? But we see that 9 by 4 is not 2, it is 2 point something. So if there is a decimal value or if it is not a perfect multiple, you simply have to do 9 mod 4 not equal to 0. So this is also a seal function, but in integer. So how much you got? This is a true value, right? 9, 1, 4, 1 equal to 0. You get 3. So exactly like what you found here. And now let's see here. That is 6 by 4 plus 6 mod 4 not equal to 0. So this is 6 by 4 is 1 plus what is 6 mod 4? 6 mod 4 is also uh, something like 2. 2 mod 0 is not so we do one that is it either gives true or false value right so here it's true value so it's one what if six mod three is there this thing perfectly fits so it will carry here it won't give a carryover or a reminder here so we just take that so this is a true value so one plus one is two that's how we got the two here and three here we simply take the product we get the area so this is the code we take uh, three numbers n m a as I told earlier, we'll take n divided by a plus n mod a. This is the clean function. This is the seal function. Uh, we are uh, doing it uh, very cleanly with uh, the integers. And this is also the seal function with integer. Now, after getting all this, you just take want to take the product to get the area. And that's it, guys. It's uh, that easy. So thank you.